when he, after he installed iOS 14, he noted that TikTok was grabbing the contents of his clipboard every one to three keystrokes. What? Ouch! Recently, after Apple announced iOS 14, many articles mentioned that the new iOS can detect the clipboard access. This is a new feature in the coming iOS, but it has been addressed from Android 10. It means a year sooner than Apple. Today, we will see how easy it is to access clipboard from an activity or a background service. So, let's get started. Open Android Studio. Start a new Android Studio project. We will create an empty activity. Next. Give it a name and select the language Kotlin. Click Finish. Applications. We will create a very simple layout just to display the content of the clipboard. Let's switch to the layout. Go to Resource, Layout Folder, and select Activity Main. So we can see both code and the design at the same time. For this application, you don't need to change much, just to uh, make a take a little bit bigger by changing the text size. 230 SP. We can change the text color. We can add an ID. Um, text here. Okay, so we have finished uh, creating the uh, very simple layout for our clipboard. We modify the code so that every time we uh, start our program, it will display the clipboard content. For codes, change. So it has focus, then we paste the uh, string value from the clipboard to the text view. That it. It's very simple. Suppose that we try to um, to copy some text. Let's say if you um, type password here and you want to copy this text, and we test if our app actually can capture this one. So you can see that um, the the word password has been pasted into our clipboard. Next, we can try another example. Nothing. And you can copy to your and drag it You can see that now our clipboard pastes another string. So you can see how easy an app can use to monitor your clipboard. Monitor our clipboard from a service. Firstly, I'll remove this old code and I try to create a new class clipboard service of inherit from service Android service. And we try to add the required members. We override on start command. All right. And here we try to monitor um, the clipboard using a thread. So, firstly, I uh, will uh, implement the runnable interface.
while true in the thread the sleep I will detect every five second so sleep for five thousand milliseconds in order to, to, to display the clipboard I will create a toast to display it then I will access it through a handler Inside the handler message method we will accept the clipboard and uh, display the clipboard content so here we create a file clipboard equal system service clipboard service as clipboard manager from that we now can display the text and finally we create a toast and display the text here okay so the last step is to to start the thread when we start the service and we will display the content of the clipboard every five seconds we will uh, start a thread then we we will display the tag every five seconds and learn finally we need to declare um, the service in the manifest file otherwise our app will crash and we start the service start the service okay so now we can test our app okay so now you can see that after five seconds it can pop up a message here it's showing the clipboard from the emulator now I'm, I'm trying to get out of the app context to check whether our app can detect the um, the clipboard and you can see that right uh, after we escape from our app there's nothing from the clipboard it will be null right and if we go back to our app you can see that now our app can access to clipboard so android currently has fixed uh, some uh, security issue regarding clipboard access sooner than iOS but anyway do not, do not copy, copy your, your, your password <laughs>